Alrighty y'all, now we're gonna show y'all, I'm gonna show y'all a simple way of doing an Xbox 360 power source. Now, I don't know how much of a good view you all got, but hi, this is Death Mag. Now, how y'all been doing? Uh, today, we actually had figured out how to take a Dell power source and reuse it. Um, this idea consists of an Xbox 360 Slim, Xbox 360, all the way. But I actually do have a power source. I'm not worried about this power source because we're gonna actually be making our own. Um, granted, it might sound a little stupid. Some people will run into a problem of not having one of these. So I'm gonna fix this issue because they have not posted any video on YouTube. This is the first video that's actually gonna be on YouTube. And it's gonna be a, I think it's gonna be a big hit. This will help y'all out a lot. Um, everybody knows the power port. Now, the power port is a very simple thing. Now, I don't know how simple it is to y'all, but it is very simple to me. Now, not everybody knows how to do this, but I do. All right, on the inside of a Xbox 360, you have these little pins here. All right, that pin, that pin, like it, it this whole thing surrounded in pins. All we need is uh, two of those pins. Actually, we need one pin and we need that little hole. All right, what we're gonna do is we're uh, with your power source. Now, my power source is an old Dell desktop power source you got two grounds 12 volt line and a 5 volt line well a 5 volts hooked up to 5 volt all right now you're gonna take your 5 volt line on the inside of your Xbox you're gonna take it right here put it in right there now you have your 5 volt connection now you're asking where's the 12 volt connection well you see that little pin right there we're gonna take our wire Straighten it up a bit, so that way it don't look too ugly. Take your 12 volt, put it in, slide it in. Now there you go. Now you got your 5 volt. Now you're asking, where's the ground? Well, here's my ground. See this bottom part of this optical port? We're going to slide it in. Sometimes uh, It's really hard to do one-handed, but I'm, do I'm doing it for the video. Um, slide it in now my power source which hopefully it will light up blue and I have no error yes 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 ah it's because I didn't plug it in all the way now we're gonna flip our Xbox this way I'm gonna be gentle with mine now if you want to you can tape those connections together now watch this now your Xbox works not everybody knows about that little neat trick. Everything works on it. Just so y'all can see how I did it again. All right, y'all see this side right here. See how you have a little divot right there? Right there. Just slide this straight down. Give me a minute, it's kind of hard to do this one-handed. Slide it all straight down. Have you have yourself an open wire and everything? You got your five volt pin, your twelve volt, and your ground. Yes, granted, my power source just turned off. The Xbox is turned off now, but this was just to show you that it would work. The reason why mine's not working is because I'm at one thousand uh, one hundred and fifty uh, fifteen watts. I can turn that up to two hundred watts, but it's I'm not even worried about it. As long as I showed y'all that it will work. Um. Now, granted, this is not a good enough watts or uh, amps for it. Actually, it is a good enough amps. It's just I have a very faulty power source. Now, if y'all get one of these, uh, if I can give y'all a suggestion, get one a little smaller than this, kind of as, as small as this. Granted, I know y'all all thinking, well, why don't you just order one? Well, some people just don't have the money to order one. And you, you have an Xbox, but you don't have one of these. You don't have an actual Xbox 360 power source, or Xbox 360 Slim in this case. 
Well, that's actually the best way to do it. I've actually played it for five and a half days off of that power source before I got this. This right here is an actual Xbox 360 power source. As everybody already knows, you plug it in, you know, da 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 da, and all of a sudden you got power to your Xbox, you know, give that light a minute to lighten up. There we go. Yes, granted it is red, but as soon as I press the button, it'll turn green and Xbox is back on. But as y'all saw, that power source will work. Um, mine's just a little bit faulty. Every so often it has an error or something. Now, with your power source, not, not everybody knows how to get these to turn on. Now, how to get this power source to turn on is, you, yes, uh, you take your um, big connector here. I don't know what they would call this in PC terms. I forgot what they called it. But it's your main connector. Yes, granted, I have a wire sticking in there. Now, that wire is specifically for a ground and that green wire. You want that green wire on any power source. Certain ones might have like a gray wire or something. You're just going to have to finicker around with it. Mine's a green wire. Uh, most of the time, most of the times you can find it on YouTube. Um, YouTube will have a power um, PC power source diagram sometimes on certain videos. If y'all want to look that up, uh, by all means, go ahead. You'll end up figuring that out. Now, this right here, take that green wire, connect it to a ground. That's all you got to do. That's how you turn on this power source anyway. But as y'all saw, that worked and turned on the Xbox and everything. So that's how you do it. Y'all are very welcome on how to get your Xbox to run with a makeshift power source. I actually am going to be turning this into a duplex, or not duplex, um, stay-at-home station power station, basically. Like, like I'm probably going to put it like, up under here or something, you know, and have my leads coming out out of my table, like right up here or something, so that way I have some place to test wires and i just threw my little thing right over here but there you go you guys are all set to actually start your gaming off your xbox if you do that